Duchess Sophie shares rare insight into sad and emotional royal first. Sophie, the Duchess of Edinburgh, is opening up about her secret trip to Ukraine. Penning a first-person account in the Sunday Times, the royal detailed her arrival in Kyiv, which took place at the end of April. Hello viewers, welcome to Royal Informate. Please make sure to subscribe and hit the notifications bell so you don't miss any updates about the British monarchy. Explaining that her trip came at the request of the British government, Duchess Sophie arrived in the capital after it emerged that there had been an estimated 169 cases of conflict-related sexual violence in Ukraine. Sophie, 59, is the first British royal to visit Ukraine since the start of the war. Aiming to shed light on the devastating consequences of conflict-related sexual violence, Sophie's time in Ukraine included a visit to an survivor relief center, followed by a meeting with Ukraine's First Lady, Alina Zelenska, and President Zelensky. He, President Zelensky, also inquired after the king's health, which gave me the opportunity to hand him a letter from his majesty, recalled the wife of Prince Edward. I think he was quite touched, and said he would save it for a private moment later to read. Among her other stops, Duchess Sophie traveled to Kiv St. Sophia Cathedral, the suburbs of Bucha and Urban, and the British ambassador's residence, before heading to Warsaw on her return trip home. Since returning to the UK, many people have said, how brave or courageous I was for going. I am neither, states the mum of two. The brave people are those, who have endured extreme violence and survived. The courageous are those who have reported the crimes committed against them. I am glad to have made the journey. Inevitably it was sad and emotional, and the painful stories and images, as with all my visits to places of conflict, will live with me. On International Women's Day in 2019, Sophie publicly announced her commitment to champion the women, peace and security, WPS, agenda and the UK's Preventing Sexual Violence and Conflict Initiative, PSVI at a reception for women peacebuilders at Buckingham Palace. At the time, she said, as someone who firmly believes in the equality of men and women, I feel drawn to your cause and to do what I can to help raise further awareness of your work.